What's up, everybody? Hanging back with here earlier. My name's Dan. With me are these meatheads, Josh, Sean, Mario. All right, today we got the second uh, trailer for the new Ghostbusters, oh, the wow. Ghostbusters reboot, remake. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, wow was right for the last one. <laughs> I'm holding that hope. We did a reaction for the last one. Yeah, yeah. Um, it was, yeah, it was, oh, wow. Uh, not sure. I'm hoping, I really want this thing to be funny. Like, just, you know, yeah. please be funny. Please, like, you have some of the best comedic actresses going today. Yeah, like the, it's got to be funny. It's got to be better. Let's, so, let's check it out. I'm, check it out. I'm holding out hope. All right. But I wouldn't bet on it. <laughs> <laughs> Under the breath. Just, it will haunt you every night. Whatever it is, no one should have to encounter that kind of evil. Except you girls. I think you can handle it. <laughs> oh, oh, good. Thanks. Alright, starting better. We have a gift. We see what no one else is willing to see. We do things others can't do. Ghostbusters. If there's a paranormal problem, we're the ones to answer the call. Hello. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. What do we think of these Ghostbusters? Are they to be taken seriously? Okay, you sweaty freaks! I'm about to save you from this! Yeah. Oh, she fell. Okay, yeah. so I don't know if it was a race thing or a lady thing, but I'm mad as hell. There's a bigger picture at hand here. Someone is creating a device that amplifies paranormal activity. We're gonna need a bigger boat. Hi right, guys, check it out! Yeah, they got inside! I was born to be a gunbuster, all right? Oh man, that's so not good. I don't know what the fuck is happening. I don't know what to do. Something big is gonna happen. Whoa, oh, is this a remake a of the original movie? Yeah! It's not like a. The government's trying to claim the I, event I get more power. power. I get more and more confused. We we'll talk about it after that. <laughs> mass hysteria. I will kick the unleaded crap out of you! And you, especially you! Uh, is that slime? Hey! Don't move! You got a. Uh... No, I'm tired. No, no, I'm listen. just gonna go ahead and take off. How about that? I, I don't really think that's a good no. idea. No, going to take off. Don't piss off the ghost. No. Really? Is that, is that Stay Pop Marshmallow? Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. Oh, wow. So, okay. Uh, so, hold on. All right, so there's, look, there's a ghost sitting on her shoulders and everyone's just like, oh. Hey. Because yeah. like, <laughs> like, look, like, I, I understand yeah. that the first one had, it's, yeah, like, Slimer was neon. Yeah. Um, there were other ghosts that had kind of a neon tinge, but the ghosts still though. look scary. Yeah. Mm, right? Yeah. They still look scary. And the gargoyles, say you will about when they ran. Yeah. 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 And so like that, because, you know, it was it's 30 years ago. It was, yeah. But the puppets and close-ups, those gargoyles look scary as hell. Yeah. They looked great. Yeah, Way better hell, than hell anything I'm seeing in this. Yeah. Yeah. And, and when they showed up, people were scared shitless. Mm. Like, they would run. Not an audience but full they were of... Taking selfies yeah. with, with, a with a ghost dragon. Yeah. yeah like, it, it, and it was like, but the, the, the timing... Like that's the thing about the original. It was the timing was there. Like even the, like the the ghosts and everything like that. They just had they they used like horror timing and they like they built up to it and then boom the scare would be there. Yeah. Here it just seems like everything's just there. It's just really good. They're showing a lot in these trailers. Like all the special effects. Like it just seems like a, a big special effects like Marvel, but they're not even good looking. Like it doesn't look right or. I I don't even know. Like I don't even have much to say. I I just. It's this. It, we've said the same thing before. There's like the the first trailer kind of advertised thirty years before. So it, like when you say that, it kind of implies a legacy that there is there yeah. is they're they're going on that continuum. But then it looks like it's just an actual reboot. Mm -hmm. And then there are things in there that are just similar. So exactly like like and, how you said exact callbacks where they're doing it beat for beat. Yeah. 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 Of, like you said, I saw the tower. Yeah. Now it looks like what was the state? Was, was it the was it the state of marshmallow man? Yeah. It seems yeah. As, it seems as such blown in half, so it's hard to see. But yeah. that's the state of marshmallow yeah, it's man. It's gotta be. Yeah. Or or or, or yeah. so reminiscent thereof. It's this big white puffy thing. Yeah. yeah it's got a yeah, bow tie. With yeah. the bow tie. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. Got... And the hat. Look at the hat. Yeah. Okay. 
So no, no. You know what this looks like? This looks like the the Ghostbusters logo. With a bow tie, though? Maybe. Look at the... They're just I don't think that's a hat. Scary. I don't know, man. I don't know what uh, it is. I, 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 look I at the I, logo. Maybe, yeah, but I don't know. Still, but it's too all I know is that I don't like it. That's what, <laughs> yeah, I, that's what I do. <laughs> that's what I do know. Okay. As a grown-ass man, <laughs> I know that... <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, a couple things wrong with it. Okay, I just want to know for sure. And maybe our fans can tell us and write us. But does a reboot mean that you have to... Is is just you're reenacting the original, or can you, you know, a do a movie of like a continuation where it's like you're you're rebooting the character? Yeah, you know what I mean. Because like right now, this looks like they're trying to recreate Ghostbusters one, yeah, and man. that is impossible. No. Yeah. That's like mm-hmm. like the the cohesion of of the the group, the dry humor, yeah. the you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. You can't do that. If they went with a franchise and it's like they bought the franchise and, and they, they made it their own, yeah. yeah. But now, if they're if they're, because from what I understand, they're totally not using um, using uh, the old Ghostbusters. There, there's no old law. Yeah. This or, is all yeah. which ghosts is so are happening for the first, because time. In the first yeah. That's what's so confusing about the first yeah. trailer because it says yeah. thirty yeah. years yeah. ago. Yeah, yeah. It's what that, we, that, that, that was a total marketing mistake. Time. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And, if, and if that's the case. That, that's suicide because that's like when they tried to do Robocop yeah. and it was like a shit show it's, it, it's sometimes it's worked and sometimes it hasn't like we're we're in the in the era now where we've seen so many properties franchises from mm. the 80s and 90s yeah uh, try try to get rebooted back out there. Whether it's been like the Freddy series, uh, yeah. they did Total Recall, Total which Recall. didn't work. Conan. Robocop didn't work. They tried Conan. Oh dear. Um, they've done a ton. And when you say what does reboot mean? Reboot means squeeze every bit of money out of this fucking thing. <laughs> That's what reboot it's, means. It's, it's almost like we're just living in this like we're just doing algorithms. It's like hey. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There's a know, built-in franchise of popularity. Yeah. Let's get it out there. Let's add uh, the these thing. people for these roles. But it's like, even the ghosts, they're using these pastel colors. Yeah. And it's almost like uh, Casper meets Haunted Men Mansion Black. And Haunted Mansion. Yeah. Something, yeah. something yeah. from yeah. Nickelodeon yeah. channel. Yeah. Like, I yeah. Think they, look, they all look terrible. Even those yeah. giant ones that came yeah. in, they mm-hmm. all look terrible. Um, it's just know. rehashed. It looks all rehashed. Yeah. But this yeah. doesn't take away from... The comedians, because maybe they're gonna do a great job with what they have. But right I'm now, hoping. from what they yeah, like, what I've seen, showing... I, I see, I see cliche, yeah. washed up humor. Yeah. Like yeah. I said, oh, that's gonna leave a mark. That was in the last yeah, one. You made me like that's all, falling off the stage. Netflix in four months. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and it's. I, I honestly think that all those actresses, they need the rated R, and maybe, yeah. and maybe yeah, even the director, I, Paul yeah. Feig, because all the stuff that I really like of theirs. Is R rated? Is yeah. R rated? Right? Well, like, yeah. And I don't know. And and you haven't seen it. And I mean, look. Here's um. Here's the interesting thing, right? Because uh, with the first trailer, there were the people that really despised it and overly hated it, and maybe hated it way too much. Mm. Um. And you know, small percentage because uh, of just outright sexism. Because there's people yeah. that don't want anyone yeah. and no characters yeah, yeah, to turn yeah, yeah. black. Yeah. yeah. No characters to to ever be female. Whatever. Yeah. Forget all that. Right. Yeah. Like I'm open to being entertained. Yeah. yeah. Um, but there's so, but but talking about reboots and going beat for beat, um, there are ones that have kind of done it right. What was episode seven? Star Wars episode seven. There yeah, are beat beat, very yeah. similar yeah. beats, but when you did it in the marketing, yeah. they started off here's new characters, yeah, new legacy, new but, journey. Yeah, but that's that's a continuum. That's a yeah, continuum. But right? they did give us beats so, for beat. Yeah, but it was still. But they did it the right. But it wasn't like a. It yeah, wasn't. Like, it wasn't like saying this is the new Star Wars episode four. Like about yeah, 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 yeah Star Wars exactly. Yeah, it was a legacy. It, it was a legacy yeah, piece. And, and it's like right? yeah, it's so. almost like like t- times that they were they were going through like trials that their ancestors had gone through before them. Mm. So it was almost like that. Like this seems contrived though like it just seems like like they're 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 literally going back to the state of marshmallow man like mm-hmm. why are they doing that if it has nothing to do with the original why is it slimer does. it does you know what i mean they're like yeah recreating the original like what what are they I mean, doing here is this... i mean it, it could work i mean again on the surface you could say everything about and i'm trying to be the optimist right yeah uh, it, because the fact is, you could pull, <laughs> you, you could pull the same thing for episode seven saying well now the the uh star killer base is a new death star and so those beats are there, but one just worked so well because what latched us in was these new characters, and that came through in the trailer. Okay, um, and this isn't coming through in the trailer at no. all. Maybe. Right? Sorry, go ahead. Um, and another point I wanted to make was uh, response to the first trailer. There was a lot of 
overly negative people right away. Other people like us who are just, you know, I think we're doing pretty object. Uh, I think we're doing a pretty objective call on it. But you can't just say, well, don't, you know, don't criticize it until you go see it in theaters. You have to go see it in theaters. But we don't see movies for free. Yeah. Yeah. Right? Like, exactly. There's a lot of movies we want to see. It's expensive. I right now, there's nothing calling me to throw down 17 bucks to see this in. Uh, like digital 3D, yeah. right? Because that's how much it costs in Canada to see these things, yeah. right? There's nothing called like. And the time, I gotta, and the time that it takes to watch one of these, like, we've all got other things to do. It's like, yeah, we can't, well, the, there's nothing compelling right now. On yeah. This. So to throw down and put, like, I'm not anticipating this at all. Yeah. And I, <clears throat> and to sit back and say, oh, don't judge it until you see the movie. The trailer is what you judge a lot of these things. I'm going to sum it up. That's, why, that's yeah. the whole point of a trailer. Sum it up and say, there's something strange and it don't look good. <laughs> yeah, but I think the reason why you liked episode seven mm -hmm. was because it stuck with a lot of what they did in episode four. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like there, there, everything wasn't a green screen. Everything wasn't yeah. like CGI. They you're used right. live sets. They used live... So do that with Ghostbusters. If you're yeah. going to re recreate it, make the yeah. ghost scary. Yeah. I think that was the whole yeah. point. It was like the contrast of like horror mm -hmm. and comedy, comedy yeah. put together. And it's like, whoa, this is something brand new and fresh. Mm -hmm. This is, and it has nothing to do because these are, these are amazing comedians. And mm -hmm. I think these are some of the top comedians of our time. Yeah. But what they put together or what the, the studio put together? Uh, my, my, my last two cents is I'm going to agree with Dan from earlier. It's like, I really think they need the R rating. Like, they're, they, it's like, it, comedians, they all have their shtick. They all have their, their niche that they, they work within. And all these come from that R rated niche. Mm -hmm. So by taking them out of that and placing them somewhere where they're, they're not in their element, it, it's coming across in this trailer is that regardless of all the special effects regardless of all that is the comedians themselves aren't standing out and they're not they don't seem comfortable they're not in their skins mm -hmm. that's what i'm getting out uh, of it. i think and i think it's just it's more it's more a, a greater global problem than that in this film it's just the actual the writing itself the the, the, the yeah the environment that the ideas that you could i think you could even make it work with without being rated r but they're just not they just didn't do it. I think That's the PG all. era is dying. And pretty <laughs> soon it's going to go right back to a wave um, of rated R. Exactly. Anyways, I, I, don't, I can't say anything else. That's, that's yeah. it. I'm tapped out. Yeah. All right, guys. So, yeah. We'll, uh, <laughs> d don't expect us to have tickets for opening night. And it is a shame. <laughs> yeah. It is a shame. We, you know, there's nothing more I'd like as another great cool Ghostbusters because Ghostbusters, oh, yeah. yeah. it is cool. But we got one great one, one average one, and then we'll see where this one lands. Uh, let us know if you're excited at all, what you thought of the second trailer. Uh, was it better than the first? I think it was a little bit better than the first, yeah. not much. Are you, you going to go see this opening night or at all? Let us know your feelings uh, down in the comments. You can follow us on Twitter at The Hero Lair. Also, don't forget to subscribe. We're trying to get to 10,000. We are very close. Need all your help to do it. Thanks, guys. Hang out with you soon. Bye. Ciao.